Hi everyone, Nick with Able Cine here, and we're at the NAB 2019 Creative Solutions booth. We're back with Greg to talk some more about some updates to the small HD line and some exciting uh, new software that you have coming down the line for those too, right? So what do you got? Yeah, yeah so um, we're debuting at the show. It's called Cine 7. It's our newest lightweight, compact, fully featured 7-inch monitor. But it's not just a 7-inch monitor, it's a 7-inch touchscreen monitor. It's super bright, it's, it's 1800 nits, so it's almost double the old 702. It's got a DCI-P3 uh, display, so it's got really beautiful color rendition. It's got all the nice inputs and outputs. You've got dual SDI in, bi-directional looping out, uh, HDMI in. We're using a two-pin locking connector for the professional power input. No more uh, barrel connectors or anything. You can use gold mount, B-mount battery plates, all the stuff that you expect from a pro monitor. But the coolest thing is that we've built in camera control software. So you can connect this monitor to cameras over an ethernet port and get all kinds of versatile control over them. And what we're launching here at the show is the control of the Alexa Mini and, Alexa and the uh, Area Mira camera. All you have to do is plug into the ethernet port of those cameras and plug into the ethernet port of the monitor and you get uh, the kind of intuitive control interface that you're used to from Airy cameras. So you've got similar to what you have on the home screen of your, uh, of your Alexa or your Mini or whatever. You've got frame rate, you've got shutter angle, you can adjust your ND and your ISO just with the touch of the screen. And what's cool about it is that it exists on, well, that's too dark, it exists on its own page. So a lot of people are shooting Mini running gun style even without an assistant or a crew you can remove the eyepiece and have a operator monitor and you can be monitoring with frame lines or if you need to check your false color and then quickly flip back to your camera control page maybe you want to check playback you know uh, check your clip list maybe you want to adjust your shutter angle to shoot a television or something it just makes it super fast and versatile uh, operator monitor solution the thing that's cool about ethernet is that for assistance on a larger production a lot of times either you're on a steady cam or a crane arm or something you don't want to have an eyepiece on there but it's really the only way to adjust the camera so you can remove the eyepiece and have a lot of camera control on this monitor mounted on the camera or you can run a super long ethernet cable and still have the same connectivity and camera control you know down a crane arm or on a camera truck shooting uh, you know on a, a running running footage on a car or something out on a big Russian arm or something similar. Awesome. All that sort of connectivity is always nice to have. And so you said right now you have it for the Airy cameras, but it sounds like there's maybe plans to add for some additional cameras yeah, on the road? Sure. We're already working on RED and Venice. And with you know we'll probably get the, the DXL from Panavision in there. We really want this monitor to become like the nerve center of camera. So you can use the monitor. You have this really familiar intuitive interface that just works really well. You know, you've got this, you just know how to use it. You don't have to think about it. So it's familiar. Whatever camera you're using, you know what you want. Know where to go to quickly change the key settings, just so that you can get the camera out of your way and make great shots. Smart. Yeah. Let the tool kind of fall away. Uh, and speaking of being the nerve center, I see on one unit we've got multiple antennas here and a couple antennas on the other. So I guess the wireless can be transmitter or receiver. Yeah. Um, so we've got four different models of Cine Seven. There's the base model, eighteen hundred bucks. Uh, it has capability to do camera control. Those are uh, user purchased upgrade licenses. Then we have the Cine 7 Bolt 500 transmitter, Cine 7 Bolt 500 receiver, and then we have a Cine 7 Sidekick, which is the universal receiver monitor that will work with any Teradek Gen 3 product. So that's Teradek 500, Bolt 500, Bolt 1000, Bolt 3000. And that's all Bolt 500, 1000, 3000, including Bolt 500, XT and LT. So all those things, as long as it's 500, 1,000, 3,000, those have compatibility. Right. So you've got a few options is what you're saying. Too many. Fantastic. All right. Well, thank you so much for spending the time with us, Greg, here. Thank a you. lot of really exciting developments. Awesome to see uh, all of this different technology previously from separate manufacturers coming together to make something greater than some of the parts, right? So really cool. Uh, so thanks again, guys. Uh, we'll see you in the next video.